While thousands of New Mexicans have lost their jobs in recent weeks, one thing the state says you should not have to worry about is health care. News 13's Jackie Kent explains what help is available. Lizay, the state's Office of the Superintendent of Insurance, or OSI, says first and foremost, no one in New Mexico should be getting billed for COVID-19 testing or treatment. We issued an order back on March 13th um, telling the insurance companies that they had to cover not just COVID testing, but COVID treatment, and they had to do that without applying any kind of uh, cost sharing obligations. If someone does get a surprise bill, they can contact the OSI. And for the thousands of people who've lost their jobs, there are three options to apply for health care coverage. The first is Medicaid. If you're under the age of 65 and making less than 138% of the federal poverty level, you qualify. For a family of three, for instance, that's about $2,500 a month. We have an income chart online at alwaysonkrqe.com to see if you meet those requirements. There are also options to apply for coverage through Be Well New Mexico, the state insurance exchange program, as well as the New Mexico Insurance Pool, which offers discounts to low and middle income households. Most people are gonna qualify, who've lost their jobs, are gonna qualify for some kind of subsidy. Okay, perfect. And we want them to apply. The superintendent of insurance also encourages people to schedule teledoc visits when possible instead of going into an urgent care clinic if they don't have to. Those telemedicine visits are billed just like a regular hospital visit. Lizzie, back to you. Okay, Jackie. The state says insurance companies have been cooperative and they haven't had any complaints lately from people getting surprise bills.